What is going on guys? This is just a reminder before the video starts. Racism is evil. All races are equal. Always side with the oppressed and never the oppressors regardless of race, religion, gender, ethnicity, and etc. Fuck the this and now here's the video. Yo, what is going on guys? I'm gonna debunk a quick uh, lie people are spreading on the internet and they say there's a white genocide. Again, this is totally made up. I live in America. It's not happening here, but there are right-wingers, typically white right-wingers who are either Christians, deists, or atheists, and they're pushing this myth saying um, whites are being genocided. In the, uh, and there's also a group of people saying this in Canada and Britain and other European countries. Well, first, let's define what genocide is. Genocide is the deliberate murdering of a group of people. An example would be um, in Burma, where Buddhists are genociding uh, Rohingya Muslims, or what happened to the Native Americans, or what the Australians did to its or original inhabitants. That's the definition of a genocide. One talking point they like to use is interracial marriage. Well, interracial marriage is not a bad thing, um, and that doesn't fit the definition of a genocide. And no one's forcing you to marry different races. It's a person's choice. So if you hate it when two people of other races get married, you're a textbook racist. As simple as that. Interracial marriage does not equal genocide. It doesn't even, it's not even close to the definition of it. Another talking point they like to use is abortion. Yeah, abortion is wrong and evil, but no one is forcing um, white couples to have an abortion. Then they like to talk about eugenics and stuff and sterilization. Um, no one is sterilizing whites. And um, a classic example in modern history of this would be what Israel's um, Israel was sterilizing Ethiopians that I hear. Um, oh, yeah. Back to what we said earlier. Um, these people who always make thousands of videos on white genocide and stuff that I hear any outrage. Or any videos of them on what's happening in Burma where these people are when there's other genocides happening in the world right now it's as if they have selective outrage and they like to push false narratives that fits their racist agenda and we see them trying to um, I'm not even gonna go into what their agenda is but it's racist um, equal rights that are fair and just does not equal white genocide diversity does not equal white genocide and again i'm gonna end the video right here if you're a reasonable person and you look at the facts and reflect upon this you see those people pushing white supremacy or white nationalism and all this other uh racist bs and they claim they hate identity politics but they're always doing it we know in reality these people are racist none of this stuff is happening and uh, it's funny, there are actual genocides and wars happening in the world, but they don't speak against it. And they actually applaud it and stuff when certain groups of people die. And these people tend to be the biggest hypocrites and stuff. And we see them having rallies for free speech and stuff. They tend to be right-wingers. Um, well, they supported a racist like Gert Wilders who wanted to ban the Quran, but... That's against free speech. Did I hear these people protesting that? No. Again, we see selective outrage by these people and they're insincere and they're pushing racism. Um, I'm gonna end the video right here, but I can go on about their hypocrisy and how they always yell identity politics when they're literally pushing um, racism. Peace.